Okay, just a little bit more editing and put in the intro and done. Oh, finally, got the um, Little Nightmares done. Man, that, that game was fun, but I'm, I'm glad I can f finally finish the other games that I've been playing, like, um, what's it called? Among the Sleep. I, I don't know. I just couldn't think of that name. But, yeah, Little Nightmares. It was fun. I got it finished. Congratulations, me. No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Uh, what do you know? Oh my God, that's new. This, this is my desktop back. Here we are guys, once again, back in Little Nightmares, and I know, I haven't been doing this game for a long time. That's cause A, I was in Minnesota for two weeks, so that kinda limits my possibilities of recording games. Uh, B, I recorded the finale, and I was gonna post it, and I went back to check to make sure it was okay. My, the, the volume wasn't working, so you didn't hear me or the game, so I, I pretty much assumed that you wouldn't like that, so. I, I'm doing it again, although my reactions to the ending are not going to be as uh, unique this time. Uh, I, I want to do it, and also this isn't going to be the finale, I know you think it's going to be, but they came out with an expansion, which these are all the levels I've been in, right? You got the jail over here, you've got the, the long-armed janitor's house, you got the chef place, you got the dinner area, and you got this final area, which I'm going to do, but they came out with an expansion. You play as another kid in the same time, the same time as the story with Six is happening. That, that's the character you play as in this one. And uh, they're going to be coming out with more levels of this expansion soon, and I'm going to be doing those for you. But first of all, we got to get the ending done. You guys have been waiting for, uh, can I, there we go. Yes, I want to reset because I beat it already. Uh, yeah, let's get into it. Here we are, guys. We're back in the elevator like before. And just so you know, I'm a little rusty. I don't remember exactly what the controls were. But we're just gonna run along on our merry way. And we're gonna win. So, this is the locked door, right? Remember how I did that whole thing in her bedroom, but I didn't know how to get the key. Well, you know that vase I shoved off the edge? Yeah, it was in that vase. I am so dumb. I didn't check in the most obvious spot. Here's her music, so... Let's crouch, and go slowly, and quietly, and not let her see me, because she kills me really bad, like you saw last time. She doesn't even chase you. She just, she just, it's just adjusting this in case it's a little messed up. She just literally just murders you. She turns around and goes like this, and you're dead. You don't even get a chance to run away like the other guys do. Okay. Okay. Are we good? We're good. Hey there! You gonna notice me? No, okay. Well, base is on here. Uh, do I know the controls? Yes, I do. Huh, I remember them, even though I didn't feel like I did. Here's that picture again at the bottom of, uh, most likely six. Okay. Doesn't look like she comes for you during this section. But we got the key. And now we can run along on our merry way. And get through that door we've been waiting to get through for so long. Come on. Come on. Run, 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 run. It pans backwards. Like, you're, there's going to be someone there, but then there's not. And all these mannequins, every single one of them I think is her. I gotta recognize that. I gotta look for the hair and the mask. And if it doesn't have those, then it's not her. Okay, here we are, guys. This is where we didn't get to last time. This door with an eyeball on it, which we saw a lot in the first chapter. We saw the eyeball doors. Now we can just go along over to here. Okay. 
Run, 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 run. I forgot the door shut. I know what happens here, but I forgot. There she is. Run, run, run. I forgot the door shut. Run, 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 run. Slide. Oh, get wrecked. You don't stand a chance in more creepy mannequins of fun. Come on. Let's just wander our way through the hall of broken mirrors. And up the stairs of pain. Into a room with yet more mannequins. And stuff. And more creepy eyeball statues. That one has hair, but it's not her because it doesn't have the mask. There's a random chair over there. But we gotta go this way. To the right. And pull open this board. Boop. There we go. You fall down every time you pull open a board. A board. Now here's this thing. It's an unbroken mirror. Oh, I threw it. Good job, me. I wonder... Hmm. I wonder what her weakness may be when all the other mirrors in the world are broken. Oh, there she is. Hey, 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 person. Lady. Oh, there she goes. Okay. So you see these little areas full of light here? It leads me over here. You need to be in the light so you can reflect it upon the person. Oh, there you go. Mm. Get wrecked. And then she disappears again. Now, guys, I know this might not be as exciting for you. Because, uh, I've already seen this and I already know what happens. Shoot, shoot, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my gosh, I'm not dead. But I've already seen this and I know what happens. But, trust me, when I go into the expansion, I do not know what happens there. That's gonna be completely new to me. She got wrecked a little bit. Okay, let's not drop the mirror this time. Oh, that scared me. I thought I was so dead. Just don't let go of the mouse button. There we go, right in the center. Perfect. Where are you coming from? Where are you going from? I'm ready. I got a mirror. Dun, 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 dun. There she is. There she is. There she is. Shiner in her face. I like how one, as it zoom, she goes closer and it just burns her and she doesn't back away. She just goes, Aah! you know, and then she falls down. Oh, uh, where's the light? There it is. You can't get me. I'm invincible. I got a freaking mirror. Oh, there you are. Oh, you got awfully close that time. You got awfully close. Oh, she's going from the same spot again. Look at her, she's just like dying on the inside. Why does she keep trying then? Why doesn't she just let me go? There's a dead end over there. I'm gonna have to go back to her room. And in her room, there are no just random spots of light. Oh. And there we go. I did it, guys. Now I'm here with a broken mirror. And now, uh, she's over there on the floor. And now I'm hungry. Ah, I hate this game. What it does to you, it makes you the bad guy. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. And then, there was like a mind blow part for me when I recorded this here. Uh, when I reacted to this. But you'll see, you'll see exactly what I mean, and I'll tell you what I think about it. Once, once we see it. I'm walking so slowly. I'm sorry. I'm just, oh. I'm so evil. I'm so horrible. I'm always hungry at the worst times. Have you realize that? It's always the worst times that I'm hungry. And then this is the mind blow part here. You see a shadow suck into me. 
and look at what six does. Tell me if it reminds you of anything. Literally, the exact same cutscene that you see in the beginning from the lady. Except it's your character. I'll tell you what this means in a second, once we get through the rest of the game. I'm going down an elevator. Hit the bottom floor. Opens up to the dining room. You see these little particles around me? And the same humming sound. The lights click off. He tries to attack me. Oh. Mm, you got a little wreck there, son. Yeah, it's like... My first reaction to this, I was so confused about what was happening here. And I kind of still am. Because there's no talking in this game. You have to figure out everything just through clues that the, 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 the characters give you. You know? And the environment. Now look at them, the ones in the back are still eating, they don't even care that I'm literally just murdering everyone. Look at that. Just wow, you know? It doesn't let me sh sprint here either, I have to walk like really slowly and dramatically. We got this door here. just slowly opens for me. And this is another thing with what I'm about to talk about. Why does the door open for me? I, the rest of the game, you have to open doors manually from switches or pushing on them or like some of them are shut like the giant gates like this. But why is it that this door, this one specifically just opened for me? Now I can't control myself anymore. I'm just walking on my own. Up to the light. Just think about that, though. Oh, look at what we hear. Little Nomi friends. Where are they, anyway? I don't see them. There we go. Hi, friends. I think those are all the ones I hugged. Like, every single one you hug shows up to say hello. I'm pretty sure... Yeah. I think I might have hugged more than six. I don't know. But they're just watching me go upwards. Just those gnomes. They're so cute, though, I want to squeeze them, even though my guy's an evil psychopath now, and will probably probably eat them if I try. But yeah. And then the credits. So, what I was going to say was that you basically became the one lady, the evil lady. Uh, you notice that you're hungry the whole game, Right? Just like the other fat people. The <laughs> fat people. But they give in to their hunger. They just keep shoving the food in their mouth, right? They don't even care about anything. But you only eat when you have to, when your stomach tells you, I've got to eat. But then, when um, you got the power from the one lady from eating her, you turn around like her, and you go, and you are able to just suck the energy out of them. Out of the other... Oh. Okay, hopefully I'm okay. It looked like it, um, I'll have to check, but something bad happened. But like I was saying, you suck the energy out of them. And then when you, when you do that, it, um, you're not hungry. And so what I'm thinking is the way the lady stayed thin and not fat like the others is she used the powers to eat things, like Six just did. And then the door opened for Six, 
because Six is now in control of the Maw, just like the one lady was. Since she got her powers, she's now in control. Anyway, that's just my thoughts. Uh, I'll see you, I'll, uh, like, uh, just really soon, actually, uh, in my next video that I do this. And hopefully this video is alright. I hope it didn't mess up. But I'll see you guys next time. Peace.